Oh my god, finally! Finally it's not a warlock, or a paladin, or a mage! Finally it's a priest. I mean, I'm not saying that I have a 100% chance uh, to win against a priest, but at least it's the first time. The first time that I'm fighting against a class that could potentially uh, provide a win for this uh, very, very uh, surprisingly difficult challenge. I thought that this challenge would be sort of fun, sort of uh, something cool to look at, but what I didn't realize when I began is that there's only one two-drop dragon, which is fairy dragon, and there's no three-drop dragons at all. Uh, there are cards that synergize with it, but it's it's just insanely, insanely bad how much you have to mulligan for low drops and how lucky must you be because this is not a sticky this is not a sticky minion at all this is just uh, you know it trades with a one drop for god's sake a 2-1 and i have no way of dealing damage anyway now this is actually the first time that i'm starting out well when i'm actually starting out with a board which is uh, in good health and shape i am you know what sign me up for raging worgen as well that is beneficial as long as he doesn't have a coin power word shield i'm fine he doesn't he doesn't i am happy he's happy everybody's happy let's just play the twilight guardian i know it might get shadow word paint uh but i would rather not play hungry dragon it might uh might cause some some bad things to happen the only reason hungry dragon is in the deck to be 100 percent honest is because it there's no other alternative uh there's no like, there's literally no other dragons that I can use instead. So, let's go ahead and kill the girl, because I don't want him drawing cards, ever. Let's hope that he gets he gets something, something bad. That is something bad, but it's something that I cannot kill in my 1-1. Uh, the chances of Hungry Dragon actually summoning a taunt are pretty small. So, I, I kind of went with... with uh, you know, with my gut feeling there. Beckoner of Evil. Alright, he gets to do one damage. He doesn't trade me a 1 1, which uh, is not surprising. I'm not really, not really surprised that he didn't uh, consider doing that. Let's go ahead and trade into this guy, play uh, Twilight Drake. There's no spells in this deck that synergize with Dragon King Sorcerer anyway, so. Um, I mean. As 4-6, Twilight Drake is probably as big as we can possibly get it. There's no card draw apart from, like, I don't know, Chromagus copying a couple of cards on Nefarian, generating a few. And I don't really want to hold on to that card for too long. Plus, a 4-attack minion against the Priest is always is always an ace in the uh, sleeve. Because it provides you with... Uh, it doesn't. It cannot be pained, it cannot be deathed. So that's uh, that's great. Uh, I kind of don't understand why he didn't decide to trade with my uh, with my 5-3. But, you know what? Who am I to judge? I think I'm going to go ahead and keep the 4-6 uh, at 4-4. Four, four, uh, make it a little bit healthy. Play another Twilight Drake. Then go ahead and trade the 5-3 uh, here. I could have everything live, but then I'm weak to Holy Nova. I don't really like that. I don't really like that. This way, we have a very decent board, a very decent Chromagus play next turn. It's uh, it's just great. I'm I'm loving this. This is actually the first game. I'm not gonna lie to you. In the two ranks that I dropped, I've uh, after the season reset, I was at rank 18, and uh, um, all of the ranks that I've dropped, I'm now at 20 zero stars. I have never actually been in a winning position in a game. I mean, I'm not saying that I'm. I am threatening lethal or anything like that, but it's actually, you know, better than nothing kind of deal right here. So, am I going to trade? Yes, I'm going to trade. Why am I going to trade? Because it's just the right thing to do. I'm going to go ahead and play Kermagus despite uh, the fear of it getting death. I am more afraid that this gentleman right here, the Kappa Fighter, is going to be running something like Mind Control, and I'm going to be fearsome of that. Uh, because seems seems to me like he has the basic uh, kind of card set, not something uh, too too overpowered. Which you know what I'm happy about. I am, you know, sign me up. Shadowward pain. I mean, <laughs> to be fair, I, I don't blame him for using that because there's literally no other minion that, but it could potentially be costly. 
All right, at this point, I'm feeling more confident. I'm feeling really confident to go face right now. Having a silence, <laughs> you know, I can cast a Dragon Sorcerer, it will get plus one, plus one, but then I will lose it right away. That can be a BM uh, move. I can summon a Deathwing, I can summon something pretty good. Is that Holy Fire? Nope. Looks like it's a Cthulhu Priest deck. Oh my god, the Dragon Lord. Okay, okay, I gotta play this. I gotta play this. Oh man. This is this is turning out to be very nice. <laughs> if he plays Shadow or Death, I'm really waiting for him to play Shadow or Death right now. No, no Shadow or Death. Oh well. <laughs> it's still gonna be a win, finally. It took it took a priest. Finally I've met a priest. I am so thankful, you don't even know. GG! We beat the Kappa Fighter. Oh man, oh man, this challenge. As you can tell, rank 20 zero stars. I've uh, I have completely exhausted my uh, stress levels with fighting with uh, versus mages, versus paladins, versus warlocks. It's just such an overwhelming ladder. I am literally speechless, but uh, it's really something great to see like people experimenting with new decks uh, over the past couple of games i've seen some uh, really really fun decks which i am going to be uh, trying out on the live stream which is happening today uh, you can check it out at twitch.tv slash the only russian i hope that you enjoyed this video uh it's been really really awesome for the past couple of days i'm uh back into the youtube games and uh, yeah, I hope that you will enjoy what's to come. Please uh, leave your challenge suggestions down in the comment section below. Thank you guys for watching. You guys are awesome. Stay awesome. You take care now. Now I'll see you guys tomorrow.